Welcome to my video on how to repair or fix the MBR. I'll begin by briefly explaining what the MBR actually is. It stands for the master boot record and it's the information in the first sector of any hard disk. It identifies how and where an operating system is located so that it can boot into the computer's main storage or random access memory. So essentially, if the MBR gets damaged or broken, you may not be able to load into any operating system. There are several ways that the MBR can get damaged. Some viruses target the MBR, replacing it with its own code, so you can't boot into your operating system. Another possibility is when you uninstall an operating system, which was using the likes of Grub to dual boot with another operating system. A perfect example is if you have installed Ubuntu alongside Windows. If you decide to uninstall Ubuntu, deleting the Ubuntu partitions in the process, Grub will be uninstalled with it, so you won't even be able to boot into Windows after uninstalling Ubuntu. So if you ever get into a situation like this, where you can't boot into any operating system because of a damaged MBR, I'm going to show you how you can fix it very easily. Now to do this, you're going to need a Windows installation or repair disk. If you don't have one of these, click this annotation now to watch my video on how to make a Windows repair disk for free. All you need is a computer with a Windows operating system and a blank CD. Once you have made this CD, you will need to run it at boot up. I'm going to use my virtual machine to demonstrate this part of the video so I can use my screen recording software. OK, with your Windows repair disk in your CD drive, restart or turn on your computer. So I'll just start my virtual machine now. I'm now tapping F12 to open the boot menu. Your computer may require a different key to be pressed at boot up to open the boot menu. The key that corresponds to it should be clearly shown at the bottom of your screen. In the unlikely event that you can't get to the boot menu or your computer doesn't have one, click this annotation now to watch my video on how to change the boot order in the BIOS. OK, I'm now going to select CD-ROM by hitting C on my keyboard. It says hit any key to boot from it, so that's what I'm doing. Just hit enter. OK, so once the CD is finished loading, select your keyboard input method. So for me, that's going to be United Kingdom. Then click the Next button. Wait for it to search the Windows installations. Choose your Windows operating system here that you want to repair the MBR for. If you only have one operating system, it will already be selected. Then click the Next button. You should then get to this window. And then from here, click the Command prompt at the bottom. OK, we're now going to input two very simple commands. The first is boot rec space forward slash fix MBR. So that stands for fix master boot record. So boot rec, B-O-O-T-R-E-C space forward slash fix MBR. Then hit enter. And it should say the operation completed successfully. Once that's come up, the second command that you need to put in is boot rec once again space forward slash fix boot so boot rec space forward slash fix boot then hit enter and once again it should say the operation completed successfully you can then close the command prompt and you can restart your computer and the MBR should now be fixed and you should be able to boot into your Windows operating system once again